Hi, uh, this video tutorial I will cover uh, template design pattern implementation. Before you watch this video tutorial, please log into my channel and watch uh, template design pattern introduction, template design pattern class diagram, template design pattern real time example video tutorials. Then come and watch this tutorial so that you will understand this tutorial very clearly. Okay. Now we will see the example where we can use the template design pattern. Suppose say I want to prepare uh, brew coffee. Okay, then what I have to do is I have to use uh, boil water, and then I have to add milk in that, and then I have to add sugar in that, then finally I have to add the uh, brew coffee powder, right? So I have to use uh, this small small ingredients to prepare the brew coffee, right? Say I want to prepare the Nest coffee, okay? Then what I have to do is I have to use the boil water i have to add milk in it and i have to add sugar in it then finally i have to add the nescaf uh, coffee powder right so if you see this uh, preparing brew coffee or uh, nest coffee the procedure is same only difference is uh, ingredients will be different right so what i can do is i can write a template method uh, called prepare coffee so in that template method i can define what and all uh, procedure or sequence i have to follow in order to prepare the coffee so i have written uh, prepare coffee template method so in that uh, step one is uh, boil water step two is add milk step three is add sugar step four is add uh, coffee powder so coffee powder can be uh, brew or nescaf coffee powder based on the coffee we want to prepare right so using this uh, template method I can prepare any kind of coffee right brew coffee nest coffee or ordinary coffee etc so now we will see for this example uh, how we can uh, uh, design a class diagram and uh, how we can uh, do the coding okay okay uh, this is the class diagram of the scenario which we have just seen uh, in the top you can see a coffee template and it has uh, abstract methods like uh, boil water, add milk, add sugar, add coffee powder and uh, this abstract methods will be implemented by the subclasses okay and uh, if you see in this uh, coffee template class uh, you can see a prepare coffee method and uh, this method is a template method it defines what and all uh, procedure or sequence we have to follow to prepare the coffee okay and this method is uh, final method uh, so why we have defined uh, this method is final method is uh, uh, so that uh, the subclasses cannot override the procedure or sequence to prepare the coffee okay so all the subclasses should follow the same procedure to prepare the coffee so that we have made uh, this method as uh, final okay and down you can see uh, brew coffee and uh, nest coffee class and uh, both uh, both of this class are uh, concrete classes and uh, it extends uh, coffee template uh, abstract class and provide implementation of uh, abstract methods like uh, boil water add milk add sugar and add uh, coffee powder okay and uh, coffee client uh, will use uh, brew coffee class or uh, nest coffee class to prepare the brew coffee or uh, nest coffee okay now we will see the code in Eclipse uh, so that you will understand more. Okay, I have opened Eclipse. Uh, now we will see the code. So if you see the class diagram, uh, in the top you can see a coffee template uh, abstract class. Uh, this is the important class. I will open that uh, coffee template abstract class in Eclipse and I will explain. So this is the coffee template abstract class and it has uh, abstract methods like uh, boil water, add milk, add sugar and uh, add coffee powder. This abstract methods will be implemented by the subclasses. Okay. And it has uh, prepare coffee uh, method and this method is called uh, template method. And this method define what and all procedures we have to follow in order to prepare the coffee. Like uh, step one is uh, boil water, step two is uh, add milk step 3 is add sugar step 4 is uh, add coffee powder and finally coffee is ready so this method is uh, uh, defined as final 
so that uh, subclasses cannot override this method and uh, change the procedure okay and uh, if you see the class diagram uh, next important classes are uh, brew coffee class and nescaf uh, coffee class right so i will open uh, both the classes and i will explain so this uh, brew coffee class which extends the coffee template uh, abstract class and uh, uh, you have seen right coffee template abstract classes uh, abstract methods like uh, boil water add milk add sugar and uh, add coffee powder so this brew coffee will uh, provide implementation of uh, those abstract methods you can see it here okay and uh, nescaf uh, coffee class uh, which also extends uh, coffee template and uh, provide implementation of uh, abstract methods like uh, boil water add milk add sugar and uh, add coffee powder okay and uh, co uh, coffee client uh, which will use uh, uh, brew coffee class or uh, nest coffee class to prepare the coffee you can see that first we are using uh, brew coffee class uh, to prepare the brew coffee and uh, next we are using uh, nescaf uh, class to prepare the nescafe okay so we are creating a brew coffee object and calling the prepare uh, coffee method to prepare the brew coffee and uh, here we are prepare we are preparing uh, coffee using uh, nescaf uh, coffee object so you can see that so i'll run this code uh, you can see the output So brew coffee preparation, uh, first 100 ml water boiled, then 100 ml milk added, 100 grams sugar added, 100 grams uh, brew coffee powder added, finally coffee is ready. Second uh, we try to prepare the Nescafe right. So Nescafe preparation, 200 ml water boiled, 200 ml milk added, 200 grams sugar added, uh, 20 grams uh, Nescafe uh, coffee powder added, finally coffee is ready okay uh, so this is the best example of uh, uh, template method uh, design pattern i hope uh, you understand uh, this template method design pattern very clearly right and uh, i have put together all this sample code in my blog called uh, ram jte you can just visit this site uh, to get the sample code okay and this is about uh, template method design pattern implementation and thanks for watching. Bye.